today. You could have been anywhere else in the world, but you chose to be here with us, and we're glad to have you. Listen, today is significant because it is Membership Sunday for South Point. Um, today we're going to be recognizing those that have become new members, and if you are not a member and would like to be a member of what we have going on, listen. All you got to do is holler at Pastor Jerry, he will get you hooked up, and you can become a part of this body. Now. 20s and 30s. I know y'all thought it was over, but it's not over. We had snow days. We had uh, all kinds of things going on, but we are back. Matter of fact, we're going to be breaking 20s and 30s in at Brock Campbell Chunky Suits House. At 5.30 at this church, we're going to meet to go over to where he lives because I believe he lives in the sticks. I'm scared to go in the sticks by myself for obvious reasons. So meet here with me at 5.30 in the parking lot of the church and we're going to go to Brock and Danny's house and we're going to eat up whatever they're cooking. Alright? By the way, I'm allergic to shrimp. Hope it's not shrimp. Alright. Top notch. You, you lucky guys. You're going to be meeting right here at the church. Um, what time is it? I think it's going to be 6.30. Matter of fact, I know it's going to be 6.30 and I know you're going to be having a good time like you always do. Um, and that's this Sunday. Now, we have a uh, what could I call delicious commercial coming up? You guys check this out. I think you're going to enjoy this. All right, how's everybody doing? I'm Lee Prince, and today we're going to be talking about the top five things that men shouldn't say to other men. Some of you guys might not know what it is. Here's number one. Hey, Cliff, check out these shoes I just got, man. Oh, man. I like them. Yeah. Man, them are, yeah. Them are cute. Did, did I say something wrong? All right. Okay. First off, cute? Really? Cute. You could have said anything else and you chose to say cute. Listen, real men don't say cute unless... Well, they don't say it at all. That's just it. Listen, if you want to say something, say something like tight, cool, awesome, something like that. But just don't say cute. Number two. Oh, man, dude. Never fails, man. Out of ink. Uh, back there in that back closet, that back room, mm -hmm. uh, there's a yellow ink cartridge, man. Can you grab it for me? Yeah. yeah the light bulbs are out, dude. I got to replace them. But you should be able to see the yellow ink cartridge. It's on the top right-hand side. Okay. Alright, appreciate it. Fails, man. It's always something. <sighs> appreciate it, Mike. What? It's, it's pretty dark, man. <laughs> what? Did you not grab it? I'm scared. <laughs> scared? Yeah. Of what? Are you serious? Okay. For the next point, don't ever, ever tell another man, I'm scared. You just don't do it. It's not wise, okay? What you do is you make up reasons as to why you can't go, like, my legs hurt, I hurt my hip, uh, I was lifting too much weight, some kind of weak, something like that. But don't ever, 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 ever say, I'm scared. Point three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, man, it's getting kind of late, dude. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and crash for tonight, man. Uh, I'll holler at you tomorrow or something. All right, yeah, I'm gonna wrap up a few things here at the office, and I'm gonna hit the bed myself. <clears throat> All right, man, we'll holler at you, hey. All right? All right, we'll talk to you later, bud. Hey, buddy, uh, night-night. Night-night? Ugh. I don't care who you are or where you're from. When you get ready to get off the phone, don't ever say to another man, night night. That's get. What's up, man? You ready? Oh, yeah, let's go. You gonna wear that? Yeah, wow. Well, is, is it made with fat or something? Come on, let's go. A little bit. I know you guys saw that. 
Now, if you look real close, there are actually two fouls on this play. One, does this make me look fat? Are you kidding me? We don't care what it looks like as long as it has our team logo on it or something like that. But don't worry about how it looks. Don't ever say that again, okay? Secondly, the other foul, you're so mean. Really? Is that estrogen? Must be. Next point. Hallelujah. Amen, brother. Amen. Man, I gotta go to the bathroom. Come with me. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing, buddy? I'm Lee. Uh, Cliff. Nice to meet you, Cliff. Cliff man, um, I'd like to meet, invite you to our men's ministry meeting. If, if, if you wouldn't mind coming, man, we have it every third Tuesday of every month. Okay. 7 o'clock, man, we have a great time. We eat food. I know you like food, right? Yeah, yeah I sure do, man. Yeah, you know, it's a men's ministry meeting, and you might be able to invite your buddy. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure you'll come. Well, you know, um, speaking of that, it kind of brings me to my next point, which is do not ever invite your friend to the bathroom with you, especially if you're a real man. Thank you. What's up, man? Did I miss anything? Yeah, man, I actually did. I met this guy named Lee. Uh, he invited us to this men's ministry meeting, man, at third Tuesdays at uh, 7 o'clock, I think he said. Uh, he invited us. You want to go? Check it out? Yeah, man, I love meetings. Let's go check it out, then. Sounds good. Amen, brother. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I was laughing too, but it's real. Certain things men just can't say to other men. But listen, that leads me into the men's ministry meeting at 7:30 here at the church Tuesday. All right. Now it's time for. The Big Scoop. The Big Scoop is we're going to have a Black History program next Sunday, all right? Now, here's the thing. I know some of you guys are thinking, why come we can't have a White History Sunday or a Hispanic History Sunday? Listen, you guys have that 11 months out the year. We just want one. <laughs> no, I'm just joking, kind of. But listen, guys, we want you guys to be here. It's going to be awesome. We're going to be having a soul food dinner direct, directly after. There won't be any pig feet unless you want some. There won't be any chitlins unless you want some. We can bring that. But listen, most importantly, bring yourself. We're going to have a good time. We want you. All right? My name is Lee Prince. I want to celebrate, and I want to connect, and God gun, and I want to contribute. See you next week, y'all.